We're here on site with Ross Bain, and he's gonna tell us a little bit about the progress happening here at Moss Park. We're pouring uh, one of the invert slabs for the, the bottom of the uh, future station. We poured the, the bay at the far west end a couple of weeks ago. Uh, we're pouring the bay right underneath us uh, today. It's, it's quite a large pour. It's about two meters, uh, two meters in thickness uh, in sections. Uh, and this forms the, the what we call the invert slab, and it, it's where the trains are going to run. Okay, so this is a pretty big hole that we're looking over right now. About how deep is it, and how much dirt did you have to excavate? We're about 20 meters wide and 31 and a half meters deep. Uh, it's about 100,000 uh, cubic meters of, of soil and of rock that had to be removed uh, in order to, to create the space that you see behind us now. Could you explain the construction method that's being used and how it's different from the other stations? Of the six underground downtown stations that we have, this is the only one that's being done fully in this method, which we call open shaft type construction. And what that means is there's no caverns. So all the other stations have some form of a cavern. Until next time, Moss Park.